Hey, Mark. <laughs> so, I mean, um, the seller mistakenly locked the screen door and she only had a lock in the, um, and she only had a lock in the, uh, for the front door. So she only had a lock for the front door. So I uh, just went around, I had to call the agent, go around to the garage and get out that way. So um, that's the front door here. So as you walk in, just like we were out, walk in and then go, actually this is the back door. This is my mistake. It's the back door. <laughs> so we are at the back door. I thought this was the front door, so it's not. So I will lock this back up and then we can go, there we go. But that's the back door there. So we already went out back as you see. So that's the back door. So I will go towards the front door and then we'll walk in this house kind of like we're walking in. So that was a garage door and I'm looking for the front door. And it was, that's the back door. So anyways, uh, kind of front of the home here. So you've got your living area, nice living area. You see she's got some nice furniture set up. And then out the small windows, again, you see just some of the outside. So you've got an area here to where they set this up as an office. So nice office area. That's what the windows look like. And then again, this is the, uh, kind of the living area there. So uh, the front door actually might, we're, we're probably, we're downstairs. So the front door is probably gonna be upstairs. So um, that's, so you got the bathroom, uh, got a nice bathroom area, nice sink, nice big area in here, some nice travertine tile, and then you've got your washer and dryer down here. So your washer and dryer will be down here in the bathroom. So that's where that is. So I have a little bit of confusion here, but uh, <laughs> yeah, this will be the downstairs. So you got storage underneath the stairs, and then we have our garage. So this is our garage area. And then that's the service door I was talking about when you see the outside video, that's the service door. So this can fit a big truck, fit two cars. This can fit quite a bit of stuff. It's kind of a longer garage and I'd say the ceilings are about 10 feet high. So um, if you want to kind of do a measurement for your car or your truck, you can just uh, measure it that way. So again, you got some storage over there. And then, you know, they just got some, of course, their personal belongings here. And then as we step out, they have a space here. This might be the water heater. So let's check it out and see. Uh, yeah, furnace. So furnace looks newer. Let's see. So, furnace and water heater look fairly new, which is nice. So you got your furnace and water heater out here in the garage area. So uh, try to shut this back. Yeah. <laughs> These old school closets, <laughs> they're like that, so where they're pretty difficult to uh, to shut. So okay. So now let's go upstairs. Turn this bathroom light out. Okay. Okay, that's the front door there. <laughs> so as we're going upstairs, got your nice kitchen. We'll walk out the front door here in a second. Nice living area. See, you've got these floor to ceiling windows and I'll show you what they look out of. They look out at this area here. I am going to, I see she has a box for some shoe coverings. So 
Let's go ahead and put these on. Uh, I will be right back. Here we go. Mark, you can just fast forward through that. So when you get to the video, just fast forward through that part. Uh, nice cabinetry. Again, that's your front door. Yeah, you got your dishwasher, got a nice sink, nice countertops, nice long space, fridge. Got your range head. More cabinets and looking out the window you see the, the driveway and then looking out the window here you see the same thing so that's where these windows look out at so that way you have a picture there kind of dining area here and then we've seen the living area so nice sectional sofa there and then uh, let's walk to the bedrooms this long hallway we have our bathroom, so nice uh, bathroom here. You've got your skylight, which is nice, nice and bright in here. And you know we have our shower tub combination up here, which is nice. Got a linen closet right here. Yep, so nice linen closet, nice and bright. These skylights are really nice for saving energy, saving daylight. You know, so. Um, that's pretty nice, especially up around here. You get a lot of sun up here. So bedroom number one. So in here, we've got a desk. We've got your nice little bed that probably looks like a single. So nice little single mattress there. And then we have our closet. So nice closet area. Very, very clean. Really, really well-kept, clean home. So... That's our master. We'll go there last. Bedroom number two. So she's got two dressers, probably had some of the furniture, and then you've got a little bit of a vanity sitting here. So I'd say this would be probably 10 by 10 if I had to take a look. And then you have the closet space here. So that's the closet space. Okay, and then here we have your master, nice size master, your attic access is here, okay, nice master, nice and big, that's a nice king, you've got your dresser here, got two nightstands, so you've got your chest area here for some storage, so you can kind of picture what you can fit in here. Uh, really, really nice. I will do the closet in one second. Then you have your ensuite. So this one has an ensuite. So you've got a you know sink, stool, shower tub combination. So that is the home. Um, I will take a look in here, but this would just be more like a regular size closet. Yeah, it's bigger because it's meant for his and hers, but. Uh, it's um it's not like a traditional walk-in closet but Woodland Park no it doesn't have one of those it's kind of have a mixture of a cabin mixed with like neighborhood home so of course your bedroom one your bedroom two your master got your ensuite there and then you have your bathroom here so we'll walk out front and then we have our downstairs you've already been out there and then your windows look to the outside there. So that's where the windows look. So we've done that. Um, we'll open up the front door because I have to unlock the screen door. There you go. So let's unlock the screen door. There you go. So, and this is what it looks like out front here. So, that's what you get. Okay, we've already. See the outside. So, I'll give you 
you one last look in here at the kitchen. Then I'll head downstairs and then just let me know what you think about this one. That's a gas fireplace, by the way, so just so you know. All right, Mark, let me know.